Did you know scientists have run hundreds of credible studies on autism, including some with over a million children, and the results are nothing like the myths you keep hearing? Autism has been described in medical journals since the 1940s, long before vaccines or Tylenol even existed. So when politicians call autism a tremendous horror show or blame medications, they're ignoring decades of evidence. And here's the shocker. The few studies that once claimed a link didn't hold up. They were debunked, retracted, and replaced by much bigger studies, some tracking millions of kids over decades, unlike those who had been doing just a few hundred participants. And those credible studies, they all say the same thing. Autism is mostly genetic. Now, my own family shows how complex that is. When my kids were tested, the doctors also tested me. None of us had the known genetic markers, but all of us are diagnosed autistic. Science hasn't uncovered every marker yet, and researchers are still finding more every year. Now here's the thing, myths spread fast because fear spreads fast, but the facts matter more. What's the most harmful autism myth that you've ever heard? Let me know in the comments below and follow along for more things I don't want you to know.